Yeah, I thought we uh, I thought we went out today. We started practice off uh, at a great, great tempo, and uh, wish we'd uh, you know maintain that same uh, that same tempo near the end. I thought we dropped off just a little bit, uh, but it was a good day overall. Again, we we had some new installations on both sides of the ball, and uh, you know so it got a little it got a little uh, sloppy out there. Certainly with the young guys again still learning, uh, which is what we expected, but. The effort was really good, and uh, we've got another practice tonight, so we're uh, we're going to stay on track of installing and you know moving forward with, with what we're putting in. So we're making some progress, and uh, you know we've got a ways to go. After going back and watching the scrimmage, what were you, what were your impressions of it? You know what sticks out to me is a lot of the young guys, and uh, you know uh, not that some of the older guys didn't play well. Uh, also, but, uh, you know, when it comes to the, uh, you know, the young running backs, I thought they had a nice day. I thought um, uh, Corey Grant ran the ball well, Trey Mason ran the ball well, and Mike Blakely ran the ball well. We gave them a lot of opportunity Saturday. That's what we wanted to do. We wanted to see where they were at. Uh, uh, Enrique Florence on the other side of the football continues to have some good days. Uh, he's, he's learning. And uh, it, the, the process has been fast back there, but you know he had a forced fumble, and he's really playing aggressive, and that was really good to see. Angelo Blackson on the defensive line, another young guy that's really coming along. Um, you know he's one of those young guys that uh, we hope surfaces, you know, not out of nowhere, but you know he's one of those guys that uh, you hope just pops up and you know does a great job for you, and he's working definitely in that direction. So we've got some young guys out there like that that we're uh, that we're really proud of. We have got to keep bringing them along along with the rest of the guys that have played. In talking to Charlton Bell a few times, it seems like he's made a conscious effort to kind of ramp ramp it up as far as leadership. Does that come across? You see that? I think practice? so. I don't think there's any question. Yeah. Uh, he was he was doing that today. You know, at the end of practice when it was you know, it was hot and everybody's tired and the whole deal, he was really trying to he was really trying to be a leader and. and uh, you know, get the energy level and, and practice up. So he's, I think he's made a very conscientious effort to do that. Gene, has uh, Anthony Goldie or Anthony Morgan done what he needs to do to kind of move in that race to be a third tailback? I, I think he has. Uh, I, I think that we've seen flashes of him where he can really do some nice things. Uh, we've also seen, you know, we've seen a lot of instances where we wish he would really step to the step to the front, step to the plate, if you will, when it comes to, you know, running the football hard, running downhill, protecting. You know, he can be for us, uh, if he'll progress and come on, he can be a really good third down back because he's got great hands. He can, he's 200 pounds now. He can protect. He's got to learn all the different blitzes that are, you know, that, are, that he's going to get hit with based on the protections we're in. So he's got an opportunity to help our team, uh, but you know he's got to, he's got to come on and do that. And again, we've seen flashes of it, uh, but you know nothing that says that you know right now he's he's going to be the one to do it. So he's got some time, but he's he's got to kick it up into another gear. Since Jay Collins kind of come on since last year and since spring. Jake has come on. Uh, I think Jake uh, is one of those guys that's very focused in on trying to be a good football player. Uh, there's no question in my mind that the more reps that he's taken, uh, along with him playing in pretty much all the games last year, you know, uh, as little or as much as he did, I think all those are building up. I think confidence is, is becoming apparent, and uh, you know, I think he, I think he's getting better. The young running backs doing some good things. Is that good to see, you, especially when you have kind of two known? commodities in, in, in Mike and in Ontario that you can allow those guys to get a lot of reps? Well, yeah, I mean, and, and, you know, let me make this clear, too. You know, we have two good running backs, but they're not all they can be yet. They're not even close. So I just want to be clear with that one, too. So they're, they're not sitting over there on the side because they've arrived either. Uh, so they got a lot of work to do, too.